Hello and welcome to the Cheapskate channel. We're going to go car hunting. We're going to go bottom fishing for cars on Craigslist today. This is a further expansion of my previous video telling about how to buy cars for a few hundred dollars up to twelve or fifteen hundred dollars. And this is just a practical example to show you how to bottom fish and I'm going to show you what kind of cars you can find there. And you're going to have to kind of dicker with it a little bit and go through the things but you want to have a car that you can drive off nothing to fix nothing that needs anything or anything of that nature you need a car you can use right then and this is the craigslist atlanta page because that's just where i am of course you need to search in your area otherwise you have to get the car shipped there or you know it just makes common sense to search for a used car near where you live and we're going to go from there down to cars and trucks we're going to click cars and trucks and we're going to go over and you see here all cars and trucks by owner only and by dealer only you want the by owner only because you'll get the best deals here you don't want to kind of fool too much with the dealers because you'll get probably marginal cars you have a better chance of getting a good car that you can work with from a private party on it and as soon as the page loads in we'll go ahead and we'll go and take a look to see what we have but I want to show you how to initialize the search first same way in my real in my real estate video where I showed you how to acquire real estate the price is the whole setup and also up here you want to kind of take a look at the image you want to do the image and lots of times I post it today but I just want to show you what you can get here so I'm gonna leave the image uh, posted today alone and we're gonna search let's search it's going to try to find a $500 car up to a $1,500 car. So, now obviously the $500 cars, you're going to find more junkers down there. And the $1,500 cars, you're going to probably find something up there you can use a lot quicker. Make and model, normally, well for illustration purposes here, I'm going to leave that blank. But normally I have a couple of favorite cars and a couple of favorite brand cars I wouldn't mind driving. Same thing for model year, odometer and all that. And we're just going to click search. And we're going to go from there and I'll show you one other parameter. And of course it's going to come up with the higher price cars. Like here's a little $1,200 Ford Escort. And it looks on the inside. A lot of nice looking little car here. And I'll show you what not to look for here after we scroll through. And I'll show you some of the possibilities here on the $1,200 cars. Let's see if I can get my scroll wheel to do well. There's a little Honda Accord. Cute little car. $900 not a bad car at all and let's take a look at it and see what it looks like and go to it and it says fair condition let's see how fair it's a stick shift uh, this is this is the perfect kind of car you want to get nice looking car Honda Accord runs smoothly it's a five-speed manual if you like stick shift they have some good automatics too but listen to this engine runs good transmission runs good that's the holy grail. You don't want things like runs hot, needs transmission, needs radio. You don't want it to need anything. All you need to do is pay the money and ride. Clean title. This is very important. No liens or encumbrances. And they have the title. Make sure the title is there. Make sure it's signed. And make sure the title is in their name. And check their driver's license to make sure it's them and not their friend's car and it says good tires that's an even better thing it says contact information and the person's name this is a good car i would buy this car and it shows additional pictures here it's an interior picture too look at that now that beats the heck out of paying and going to the dealer and paying full coverage insurance and buying a marginal car that you don't know anything about i would buy this car nine hundred dollars a 97 honda accord it's still a good little car. It's not a 2015, but hey, look at it. It's a good car. It'll get you where you need to go. Let's take a look at a few other cars here. See if we can get lucky and find something else like that. There's a little Toyota Corolla, a little bit higher in price. And let's see. Let's go down the line here and take a little bit, a bit different look. There's a little pickup truck. Uh, okay. But you see what I'm talking about here. These are examples of cars that you can get is a little Volkswagen. Hyundai Sonata, 
Buick Rendezvous. Well, see, now this is what you have to watch out for. Fixer upper. You need something you can drive right then. You know, because nine times out of ten, lots of people out there are not a mechanically oriented. I'm a shade tree mechanic myself. But, uh, you know, you, you kind of want to. But, oh, watch out for this too. You look at this. It's on a dolly. Uh, you don't you don't want cars that are on top dollies flatbeds all that I don't want all this supposed to look at this thing's been in some kind of situation here I mean you know it looks like it's been an accident something has happened you know you don't want that okay well I'll tell you what let's do let's go back up the page here and let's go back and let's take a look at the lower price vehicles at the bottom here let's see if we can get all the way back up and what we're going to do here if I can get this to act right is take a look at the cheaper vehicles and you see the we're going to search from the lower price up to the higher price vehicles now and here you see a $500 car oh, you don't want that and you don't want some of the other cars here now this is a good one there as long as it's not a dealer it looks like a pretty good car that's a five hundred dollar car but now remember we found a nine hundred dollar car a little minivan there astro van car part you see more car parts and more vehicles that need attention down in this range but you kind of get the idea about what we're looking for here we're searching for a car in those price parameters and we're searching for a car that has some kind of good condition that needs nothing we need something that needs nothing here's a nice little honda prelude five hundred dollars which is which is which is which is something we're trying to do we're trying to do with this thing and that's the idea on this video so if you need this video or you need to have if you felt as though this helped you in any way please like and share this video and uh, please also subscribe to my webpage Thanks a lot for watching, and that's it.